How to Calculate Percent Purity from Gas Chromatography Imagine you have a mixture of chemicals and you need to know how pure each component is. Gas chromatography, or GC, is a powerful tool that can help you do just that. So let's dive into how you can calculate the percent purity using GC. First, you need to prepare your sample. This involves dissolving your sample in a suitable solvent and ensuring it's free from impurities that could interfere with the analysis. You might need to filter or dilute the sample to get it just right. Next, you set up your GC instrument and inject the sample into it. The GC works by separating the components of your mixture based on how they interact with a stationary phase and a carrier gas, like helium or nitrogen. The components will separate and come out at different times, creating peaks on a chromatogram. Now let's talk about the chromatogram. This is the graph that shows the peaks corresponding to each component in your mixture. To calculate the purity, you need to measure the area under each peak. One simple way to do this is by using the triangulation method, where you multiply the height of the peak by its width at half the height. Once you have the areas of all the peaks, add them up to get the total area. Then, take the area of the peak corresponding to the compound you're interested in and divide it by the total area. Multiply this result by 100 and you'll get the percentage purity of that compound. For example, if the area of the peak for your target compound is 80 and the total area of all peaks is 100, then the purity would be 80%. However, remember to exclude the solvent peak from your calculations as it doesn't count towards the purity of your sample. To ensure accuracy, it's also important to use reference standards. These are samples of known purity that help you calibrate your GC and make sure your results are reliable. By comparing your sample's peaks to those of the reference standards, you can accurately determine the concentration and purity of each component. In summary, calculating percent purity from gas chromatography involves careful sample preparation, accurate peak area measurement, and comparison with reference standards. By following these steps, you can get a clear picture of how pure each component in your mixture is.